In this lecture, I am going to teach you how to use jump and label instruction in TIA portal. Let's see. My TIA, I have to open up the TIA. My TIA, TIA is open. Now I have to add some uh, networks. This is my anode contact and this is my output. I also add one anode contact in a uh, second network and I go to the program control operation and add a jump instruction. Now jump is added. Jump is correspond and is related to the label. It's, it should must have some label where it is it is going to be jump so i add an another uh, uh, network and add another network now i add a label this is label i put a label here i name some label i let's say it is a my label you can give any a uh, label here so i add another network this is label I give name the same which was given on the label so jump has a label the same name which I have put it here so now I give to uh, addresses to the my contacts and coils i0.0 is my contact address first input and this is my q0.0 now this is my i0.1 and this is my jump this is my i0.2 this is q0.2 this is my i0.3 this is q0.3 i write a very simple program for understanding the uh, jump and label instruction now this is i0.4 this is q0.4 now this is basically my very simple program what the program will do this is the main uh, question when i uh, switch on the i0.0 q0.0 will on normally no issue nothing will happen and if i will not on i0.1 then program will uh, execute very very uh, sequentially from top to bottom uh, when I put on uh, I0.2, Q0.2 will be on and if I uh, switch on the I0.3 then Q0.3 will be on and same as I0.4 will be on, Q0.4 will be on. But if I put on I0.1, it will jump to the my label and if I on switch on the I0.4 this will be on but in the when this will be on i0.1 is on this is on this will jump here so black network number three and four will not be scanned by the plc they will not be executed if i switch on the i0.2 q0.2 will not on let's see by downloading the plc program i have to see i switch on the simulator this is my IB0, this is 0 .0, 0, Q0 0.0, let's say I go to the run P and switch on my, uh, download my PLC program, start search, I load my program, it is compiling the program, it's a very versatile, very great software portal load again and I have to monitor on off monitor my uh, input output address now I manage my IOS let's see if I switch on the I0.0 then Q0.0 is on if I will not jump then I0.2 will be on Q0.2 will be on if I switch on Q0.3 I0.3 Q0.3 will be on now if I switch on I0.4 Q0.4 will be on but I switch on off my all inputs 
now i apply a jump i apply a jump i0.1 i apply jump i0.1 jump will be on now these two between jump and label networks will not be scanned by the plc now i switch on i0.2 that is my uh, on but it is not q0.2 will not be on this is not scanned by the plc there is no output to be on if i switch on q i0.3 my q0.3 will not be on because plc will jump from here to here but my i0.4 will be on q0.4 will be on let's see this will be on this will be on so what we learn we learn that if we apply jump instruction to, uh, so uh, the uh, network between jump and the label will not be scanned by the plc when the jump is on this is my uh, lecture on jump and label instruction inshallah we, i will come with new lectures in english series thank you very much